Ken Connor, maybe just a reaction to the, the additions that were made yesterday and maybe notably, not really subtractions in terms of guys being traded away. Um, yeah, I thought yesterday was a great day for, the, for, our, for our team. Um, obviously adding two um, great players, but uh, great people as well. Um, you know, character guys that can help our room. And, um, and obviously their on-ice game is, um, is strong as well. So um, I think two great additions, and obviously the fact that we don't have to send anyone away um, helps a lot. What do you think they can bring to this team? Um, well, certainly I think they can bring... Um, you know, some grit, some um, some um, compete for sure. I think uh, Adam obviously is having um, a career year um, and has been on a, you know, having you know good years back to back to back here and you know, scoring goals and killing penalties and doing lots of really really good things. And, and Sam, um, you know, just a, a hard player to play against. Uh, you know, makes it makes it difficult for um, other teams. I know when we were in Anaheim, he's uh, he makes it uh, he makes it makes a long night on the face off dot and plays hard and um, does all the right things. What do you think about the flexibility, especially Adam, can bring to the lineup? You know, play top six, uh, third line, center wing, all over the place. How, that, how does that help? In this game? Yeah, it certainly gives Chris uh, and the coaching staff some options as to uh, how they want to set up the lineup. Um, you know, we have lots of good centermen, um, we have lots of good players, and, and um, you know, can set the lineup however he feels. Seven centermen in your top 12. What does that, you know, as one of them, what does that mean? Well, it means you're strong in the face off that. It means you're, um, you know, usually centermen are pretty smart players. I think. Uh, all seven of us, seven centermen that you said, uh, as you said, in the top 12 um, are smart players. Um, you can't have enough hockey IQ on a team, so I think that's a, that's a good thing. So centermen are smarter than wingers, that's what you're saying? Uh, generally, that's what I'll say. <laughs> I mean, it's not, does, it doesn't go for everybody, but uh, it's usually usually how it goes. But. <laughs> <laughs> oh, i gotta, I got to stop talking about this one. <laughs> yeah, when you look around the room, I mean, you had Corey Perry's experience. Adam Henrique's been around a really long time here. Like, you, you've got a certain level of experience that you're kind of loaded up with right now. You think that can be a difference maker? I think that's great. Um, you know, guys. Uh, um, we're definitely not a, a young group, a young group in here. We, uh, you know, lot guys with lots of experience, guys that uh, have gone all the way, guys that have um, just different experiences. I think that's all, all positive stuff.